because I've had a lot of sleepless nights. I'll be honest, this is my baby, and I've, I've uh, you know, built this from the ground up. Wyatt Wasilenchuk lives in Minot, North Dakota, and runs a cell goaltending. For the past seven years, he's been running summer goalie camps in both the U.S. and Canada. But in June, it became clear he wouldn't be crossing the border. I would have been traveling, doing camps in, in North Dakota, in, in Montana. I'd be heading then up. This week, I'd be in Regina, followed by a camp in Edmonton, and then I'd be at a camp in Saskatoon. Wasilenchuk says he made a promise to the kids that he would be at the camp this year and turned to technology to keep his summer camp alive. I said I'm going to be there as much as I can. I'll be it on an iPad, and it's been great. Um, even seeing some smiling faces, some tired faces, I'll be it. Um, it's pretty cool for me. Wasilenchuk appears on an iPad and watches the athletes every move, giving them pointers and puts them through their paces. But it couldn't happen without local coaches, and he needed more of those this year. With me not being there, I've overstaffed all of my camps. You know, I would typically have one kid to every, uh, three kids to every one instructor. Now it's greater than that. I've got two or three extra instructors on the ice. The increased instructor costs and the added expenses for cleaning supplies and masks has all cut into the bottom line. Paying a few extra instructors this year. A um, few extra dollars out of my pocket in terms of, of being able to run this camp meant nothing to me. If I broke even at this camp, I would still run it and I would still be, be going forward with everything. Wasilenchuk says even though he can't physically be in the rink, the reward of coaching is still there. It's worth it for the kids. As much as this is, yes, this is my business and this puts a roof over my head. Um, there's nothing... I get out of it more than, than training and, and seeing kids grow. Fiona Odlum, CBC News, Regina.